So I had made a video about this competition orange Celine Mustang. It's one of two made that was fully optioned out. And uh, I talked about how the owner of this car's son had contacted me and told me that this was actually his dad's car and he had tinted the windows. But other than that, that was his brand new in the first picture at the dealership. And uh, this nice young man has had a silver Mustang GT, which I talked about in the other video, as well as an 01 Celine Mustang. And he had given me some updates on uh, his dad's car. He actually sent some more pictures and a little walk around video. This competition orange looks really good on this car. This is definitely a special car. And the Celine Mustangs do seem to hold value pretty well. And they are pretty neat. I mean, this is a pretty rare and neat car. You'll never really come across another one like this. Maybe at a car show somewhere. But this is just a really cool looking car. And it's very special. So here's a little walk around video of the car running. We talk back and forth, and I have a lot of really neat conversations like this with a lot of people, uh, especially through private messages on Instagram, and they'll send me pictures and things. And this is a blue Mach 1 that he was interested in. It looks like it's an 03, judging by the Fender badge. I'm pretty sure it was an 03 Mach 1. Uh, it definitely was, yes. And uh, he had showed me this car, very nice condition, low mileage. He was thinking about buying this from somebody and uh, you can see the engine bay looks pretty stock and with low mileage cars that's kind of what you want to look for something like that pretty original the interior looked fantastic the comfort weave in the seats looked beautiful and so he had looked at this car but decided not to buy it and then he looked into the terminators he really wanted a terminator this is a sonic blue convertible that was for sale up there and he was interested in this car a lot but then he finally ended up buying this a zinc yellow 2003 mustang cobra and i'll say this is one of my favorite terminators so this is a really good choice and uh, this being a coupe and everything is right on my top list of uh, Cobras of the ones that I would like to own there you know I have competition orange and torch red those are my favorites but next in line would be a zinc yellow like this I think this is a fantastic car the paint the body looks great the seats look fantastic this is really neat I, I do like the uh, graphite inserts on the seats like that I think they stand out a lot so very happy for him to have picked up this Cobra and uh, especially because he loves these New Edge Mustangs and I love meeting people like that who are so much like me. So here's just a little picture of the car. And something else we had talked about was he had an 01 Mustang Cobra that was zinc yellow, it was a convertible, and it was a parts car. And he had just informed me that this car has actually been sold to someone who wants to restore it. So that is great news. I have a whole bunch of 99 to 01 Cobra videos. These cars get parted out so much that I can't believe there's any of them left. I, I see so many of these cars getting parted out. And uh, this is really neat because if you look, it has Cobra in the back bumper. That was a 2001 bumper only on that car. The Terminator has a different back bumper, and the 99 didn't say Cobra in the back, and so even that car is just special the way it is, and being zinc yellow and convertible is a pretty rare option too, so I'm glad somebody bought it. I hope they uh, do restore it like they said they would, and uh, that would be great to see any updates on that, so thanks for watching. I just wanted to make a little bit of a video on this. There's so many cool messages like this I have with friends, and I want to put them out there so we can all share and enjoy together. But this is the kind of stuff I get to deal with every day. So thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. Stay tuned for more Mustang content.